Welcome back. I'm Carlo Cicchetto. And I'm Barbara Lee Edwards. The election is now less than six weeks away. Our Count Me In reports are our commitment to you to make sure your vote counts. We're here to address your questions and concerns about the election. That includes some key dates that you need to know about. News 8's Shannon Handy lays out the timeline for us. The registrar's office started mailing out these sample ballots today. It's the first of several crucial dates leading up to the upcoming election. Voters need to be informed of what these changes are looking like. San Diego County Registrar voters Michael Vu says this year's election is unlike any we've ever had. For starters, every single registered voter will get a mail-in ballot. It's the presidential race. And there will be fewer polling places, but they'll be open for four days instead of one. As opposed to having 1,600 precincts that we would normally have, we will only have 235 of them. Aside from knowing about some of the changes, you should also be aware of crucial dates, starting with October 5th. That's when voters can expect mail-in ballots. It's also when you'll be able to vote in person at the Registrar Voters Office. Next up, October 6th. That's when 126 drop-off locations throughout the county will open. If you haven't registered yet, that's okay. The deadline is October 19th. October 27th, that's when voters are encouraged to mail in their ballots if you're not planning to vote in person. With so many more people voting by mail this year, it's to ensure the Postal Service gets your ballot in on time. October 31st, yes, Halloween, is when 235 so-called super polling places will open. Keep in mind there are fewer polling places this year and your location may have changed, so make sure you check the address on your sample ballot. November 3rd is Election Day. Polling places will be open from the 31st through then. November 20th, all ballots must arrive at the Registrar of Voters. Finally, December 3rd is the date the Registrar must certify results by. Who understands it's a lot to keep track of, which is why his office is working overtime to ensure voters are aware and ready to make their vote count. We have not had really any rest for over a year now. We've worked weekends and weeknights. There's a big operations that's happening right now. For more information on the upcoming election, just log on to CBS8.com and click on the help button. All right, thanks, Shannon. And again, we want to help answer any questions you may have about voting this year. Just text your question to 858-571-8888, and we'll try to answer as many questions as we can.